from his brother. What's the story? Well, it looks like the taser may have caused a seizure, but we won't actually... May have. May have. What else could it be? He's never had a fit in his life. Look, your brother was given a sedative to reduce the chance of another seizure. He'll wake up soon and we'll reassess him then. Yeah, right. Sorry, Doc. I know you didn't put him there. Dizziness? No. Headache? Oh, not too bad. Yeah, I'd still like to keep him in overnight. And you will need to monitor him for the next couple of weeks. This sort of injury can be really unpredictable. What's the story here? Pressure from the steering wheel caused toxins to build up in her system. When the toxins were released, they attacked her heart and kidneys. So what can you do? We're still trying to stabilise her. Yeah, but is she going to be OK or what? We really don't know at this point. She's in critical condition. As soon as I know more, I'll let you know, OK? Please fire! Please fire on the firing line! You stupid goddamn shave tail son of a bitch! Weapon pointed downrange, or I will shove that fucking piece up your sorry fucking ass. Now look at me, Lieutenant. The gun is right. You guys always wanted good coverage. Well, I think I've covered all the angles. Now for the content. You wanted a show? I'll give you a show you'll never fucking forget. Now. I expect everyone to take a leaf out of Captain Cook's book and eat their meat. <laughs> How about you, love? I know you like a bit of sausage, don't you? <laughs> I can tell by the look on your face. <laughs> Come on, don't be shy. Tuck in. I can't apologise enough for keeping you guys waiting. Just tell us our baby's OK. So it was just the one instance of bleeding late last night? Yeah, that's right. Let's see what's going on. Okay, what's wrong? What, what's, what's Look, it can be a little tricky to find the heartbeat, that's all. There you go. You're nine weeks? Yeah. 150 beats per minute, that's perfect. What's the damage? Well, it's what we expected. The ultrasound shows a solid lump, so we'll need to do a biopsy before we can give an absolute diagnosis. Right, so um, what does that involve? Well, we remove some tissue from the lump and send it off to the pathologist for examination. Mm -hmm. Um, when do you recommend that I do this? If it's okay with you, I'd like to do it now whilst you're here. Really? Now? We could reschedule for tomorrow, but I really... No, no. How do you feel? Like someone stuck a needle in my breast. How long will it take for the results to come back? I've sent them off to pathology with an urgent request. We'll give you a call as soon as we get them in. What do you reckon the chances are that the lump's nothing to worry about? Well, look, you know, it could be benign. So it mightn't be anything at all. That's what we're hoping for. Oh, you and me both. <laughs> Either way, it's, it's a good thing you came in and got tested when you did. 